Hello guys and welcome back to the next episode of City Skyline, the transporting Westwood scenario. Thank you all for your help that you've been giving me in the comments below. Lots of fantastic ideas and a couple of things that I missed in the last episode which we're going to fix up as well. But things are going very well. So the idea of this scenario, if you haven't seen it, is to transport 1 million people by public transportation. If we go have a look at the goals there, 1 million people. We've got 700 weeks to do it with flying through the week so a few little things to fix first of all and then we're going to get into our train network this is something that i want to set up so first of all i've been going around upgrading some of the roads um i could do with changing these ones back again uh, the roads i had going through the sort of i wanted to upgrade some of the longer connecting rows that we've got through here and this is probably a good example i haven't changed these ones yet um i put a lot of these medians with turning ro uh, turning lanes in everywhere which are good they keep things moving like that truck there straight through these guys are turning um which are great for junctions so probably these shorter roads i'll leave them as they are but for like these longer connecting ones here they're much better people can go 90 mile an hour on those they whiz along which is good so I've changed a lot of them back to these, uh, or over to these 90 mile an hour national roads. And then when we get to a junction, I'm putting like the turning lane ones in. And that is actually working quite well. I haven't done it here. Um, it's not too busy there. Actually, I may just change that back if we can. That's this one. Oh, no, I can't because that's a much bigger road. That's why it's like that. Uh, this is probably saying it's multiple problems. What's wrong? No road access. Really? I just saw lorries coming in and out. Building is set to empty its contents and therefore not working. Okay. It should have road access. I saw trucks coming out of it. Yeah, I'll worry about that later. But anyway, like this, this long stretch here. 90 mile an hour roads working really well. So I'm going to go through and sort of fix some of those as we go along. As I spot them. Like this here. Now it doesn't need to be that long. We don't need those little roads there. So we'll change all this. Yep, and even right at the end. That's going down into quite a small road. Could I even squeeze a turning lane one in there? I could, but it would destroy that building. But actually, overall, that would help things move along. Uh, the other thing, the other little thing that was, that, that was mentioned was this here i've got this obviously set as a highway road i should have done that with the sound barriers of course so let's find that one that's this one here and upgrade all of these and that has that nice little sound barrier there we go to stop all the noise from this roundabout because it's a pretty big and noisy roundabout so let's just quickly run around the outside of this and upgrade it didn't do that one that one that one and that one there we go lovely because there were a few people here saying they were getting sick and that will certainly help with that why are you what <laughs> what are you doing what are you doing why are you going round this one to carry on on that road there that is very weird did you want to go down there and then change your mind i've never seen that happen before <laughs> very strange very strange uh, these have been burnt down let's just delete those they'll get built up again uh, and the one other thing that someone pointed out to me was over here i'd added in what i thought were going to be farms and they've ended up being normal industry well that is because let's go to our district this district needs to be extended there we go to take all of that in and they will instantly change over there we go they're closing down and coming back as farms i may have done that elsewhere i did yes look all of this none of these are farms i think these are but these aren't yes there we go so let's do the same over there fill in that area there that will probably do for now for this section let's just double check oh yeah they're going look they're going just want to double check that this is a farming area Yep, there we go. Farming. That's fine. So they'll sort themselves out. How is this going here? This is quite a busy section along here. This is the 90 mile an hour quick road, I believe. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Two lane highway, national road. Yep. It's just a very busy junction. Ah, yes. We've been waiting for this to empty. Emptying finished. Hooray. We can finally put this roundabout in here that we've been trying to do for ages. Yep, that is going to go. 
Oh, and the other thing was, I put in this power station here, this oil power station, wasn't connected to the road. Thank you for those that pointed that out to me. I probably would have noticed it eventually. Uh, let's take out all of these. Don't need those. And let's sort out this junction here. There we go. That should work a lot better, hopefully. Why are they stopping? Don't stop. Have I made it so they can't go anywhere? I think I've broken the roundabout. Well, that's very strange. There's, um, let me, I've got this running on one speed. Using these little median turn roads, it seems to confuse the cars. I don't know why. They don't like it, and then they sort of stand there looking at each other before they go. That's really weird. Um, maybe we'll just put those back to national roads here, and then it will start working again once, there we go. That is very strange. I don't know why. I was hoping that would sort of help things move a bit. It's backed up a bit because I've been sat there waiting for it to go. Very strange, very strange. Hopefully that will keep moving. We'll, we'll come back to that in a moment. So, now for trains. We've had a lot of comments about what to do with the trains. Whether to have, like, a central hub. Or oh, you're still complaining you've got no road access. Let's just make this road a bit wider here. I'm thinking that's what it is. It was a wider road before, but you won't let me do a wider road. I want to just stop this message popping up, and then we can then we can carry on. I'll go down the side here or something. No, this is where you want your road access, isn't it? They're still going in. Okay, forget it. Forget it. Ignore him. Ignore him. Um, yeah, whether to have like a central hub and send the trains out, or whether just to have a loop going round. What I'm thinking of doing is having, um, because we just want to move the people around. We want to get as many people moving around on the transport as possible. Rather than having a central hub, which is going to very, is really going to complicate matters, is having a train station in each town. And having trains that go around maybe this section here with a connection point that goes across the river and then a loop here and a loop. I'm not quite sure how the loop's going to work over there. Maybe these will be in a loop and then these will be in a loop and have another connection and do it that way. And I think that would work quite well. So I think, first of all, let's just slow the game down a bit. Let's put in our train stations first of all. Uh, that's buses. That ain't going to help. That's metro trams. We'll come back to all of these. Lots of people saying, do trams, do underground roads. People seem to like underground roads. For instance, people want to get from here to here. So they don't travel through all of this. They would just say, put an underground road from sunny side woods all the way up to there. Yes, I could do it. To me, that's not very realistic. So I don't do it. <laughs> I don't just want to hide the traffic underground. I want to actually solve the traffic and do things realistically. Right, let's put a little train station in each of these areas. Uh, this is the one, isn't it? Yeah, train station. We don't want it. They're going to give us some noise. If we look on our noise pollution 115. So let's maybe put it slightly over here. And if we do it right, actually, we could probably have a train station serve. Yeah, we don't want to have too many train stations. We just want to get people travelling by train. So we don't want to give them the excuse to walk if there's a train that they can take. I've got to think about here where my train lines are going to go as well. Um, if we have a train line come from Aspen to Prospect, it can come round the back. We could go over here, stop at Franklin, and then it's going to come along here and round there. Okay, that makes sense. So the train is going to come off of here somewhere. It's going to go. I'm not going to connect that up to there. It's going to go here. This will make sense when we start doing it. In fact, that road is going to come this way a bit as well. It's going to go there to give us some space. Yep. So that's one. You're happy that you've got a train station, even though nothing's happening with it yet. We're going to have another one here. Even though it's very close, I think people are going to take this train station and they're going to love it. So this one needs to sort of be this way. So if we sort of go... Like this. These, these, may, these may get moved later. But just to sort of give us an idea. And then that's going to come round to over here. To the farms. Oh dear, what's happened here? 
The real cereal is burned out. I've, I've got to automatic deletion off at the moment. I could perhaps put that on. Demolish, burn, demolish, abandon. Let that work away on its own. Uh, this one here is going to be like a little country station. So that's going to be sort of along here. So in fact, I'm going to bring out this road to here. Now don't forget, we are literally just going for getting people... Wow, we've gained 10,000 more money. Excellent. Well, thank you very much. I didn't know that was going to happen. So this isn't necessarily... I just spoke about realism and stuff. This isn't necessarily now going for realism. This is just getting people to use the train station. That's what we want. Right, okay. So this one. So that's going to go there to there to there to here. Then it's going to circle back up to... I mean, we could even include Cherry Tree Town in this one. I think that would be a good idea. I want, or should we have the change over here? No, let's have the change over here and keep it a bit separate. We may end up with a couple of stations here and people cross from one to the other to go across there. So we want this one to come maybe here and then it's going to loop round. So let's see, we have that. I'm trying to still get it in the middle-ish of town without bothering people too much with the noise. If my line comes there, runs down this road, we can have it sort of here. Let's go for... Nope, that's not the road I want. Let's upgrade that. Let's maybe delete half of that. Yeah. We're going to put it here. I know it's sort of it by the town. I mean, that's quite a bit of a radius for noise. But hey-ho, people will deal with that. So that will come in there. That will then loop round here and come into what's going to be... Oh, hello, it's an aeroplane. <laughs> we haven't done those yet. What will be our central... We'll have, like, a not a central hub, but a crossing point here. Not quite sure how I'm going to do that bit yet. This is getting quite busy here, isn't it? These turning lanes, I'm not entirely sure they work, you know, because look. Oh, there's traffic lights as well. Ah, they don't have... See, in England, we would have these sort of roads. We would have a separate traffic light there that would enable people to turn right. If these guys are only going left, I don't. Yeah, there's probably mods to add to do that. To do that, I don't want to add all of those. <laughs> we'll keep it as it is. We'll keep it as it is. Okay, so then we've got this one here. That's going to sort of curve around and come to here, and then go up to here. What are you complaining about? Not enough electricity. That is probably because. Let's quickly solve that. Just stick my budget up a little bit. That'll deal with that. Good. Do we have some loans we can pay back? We do. Payment left. Payment plan. 8,000. We could pay that off. We could pay that off. There we go. That's going to earn us some more money. Oh, thank you. Th get a thousand money. Excellent. We've hit a target. So that'll come round here. This will be the changing spot. And I'll have like a walkway going over the top from one to the other. Yes. How are we going to do this bit? I'm going to try and get rid of this dump. Let's try and solve this problem with the dump here. I'm not liking the fact that it's complaining all the time. Let's... Get that as close as we can. Yes, there we go. That's not complaining anymore. Good. So then if we run... Mm -mm, that may just actually come straight in and out rather than looping around. So that follows around here. We're going to want a road up here. Can I fit two train stations in there? I can. So that literally may be it. We may just have it right here like that and have two like that. So it comes in there and then the other one goes out over here. This one's got to come in here as well. I may need to change that, but we'll see how that goes when we start linking things up. We've got enough money to mess around, so I'm not overly worried. Um, this over here, this industry could do with a train station. They're probably not so worried about noise, but what I'm going to do... You're still complaining about electricity. Okay, let's... How's my oil plant going? 
Still getting plenty of oil. I may just add another oil plant down here. There's not too much traffic. There we go. Nice connection to the outside so they can get their oil. This one I'm going to stick at the end. Let's have a bit of a curved road. Uh, no, let's have a straight road just so it goes on. Let's carry that out a bit further. Oh, slope too steep after all of that. Oh well, there we go. That's going to go there. Might as well delete that. And... Just have that go into the end. Good, so that'll go up and down there. We'll work on that one. It's going to take out a few of those businesses, but hey-ho... Could have actually put it here, couldn't I? Do you know what? I'm going to move it after all that. Let's move it there. And then those industries will come back again, I assume. Yeah, sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, folks. Move back in. Yeah, that'll be better. So that's that one. And then finally, Sunnyside City. So that's going to come down there, cross over there. I feel like I need it right in the middle here somewhere. Let's see if we can get a road to come out here. Oh, it's going to be so close to this other one, but people are going to use it. So they definitely are. Yep, there we go. So they're like little local train stations. Yeah, that looks good to me. Let's make sure all these guys have got water. Some of them don't. And they're already complaining. Good gravy. And that's that one. That one's okay. These ones are fine. Good. Are we running out of water? Water availability is low. Let's solve that problem then. What have we got over here? Oh my goodness me. Oh, okay. That's the output. No, that's fine. How's my output going? Sewage treatment. Let's add another one of these. Make sure that's hooked up. Power's fine. Yep, good, good. And then water pumping in. That's up here somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Let's add another couple of those. There we go. Excellent. So that'll take care of that. Good, good. Oh, is this finally empty? Right, okay. Let's... Yep, we'll delete that. How is our trash going? Incineration status is green at the moment. So we've got room here to monkey around with this if we need to. These guys are going to need power. Let's just hook them up to the network like that for now. Okay, good. Right, let's run some rail. This is going to be interesting. have got this set up right. Let's just follow this around. So from this one here, they can go to here. 
This goes underground, comes up there, stops off at this one. That goes nicely over the houses here, which I quite like, and then stops at that station. That one loops around the back, down by the coast, stops into here, which is good. Then if they wish to carry on through, they can go... This is weird, this one here, look. I've got this connected here. It won't just connect underground. It has to go above ground. It's weird. No matter how many times I draw it in, if I delete a bit of this or put it back in again, it wants to... It wants to go above ground, then down underground again. Yeah, whatever. So it goes here, underground, if they want to go this way. Or it loops around, as you saw. Let's go underground again. There we go. Loops around underground and goes up over here. So that connects to this one. And then you've got the sort of junction here if you need it. So that can then come back down towards where we first started. Or if they want to go down, they can go back the other way. Because, I don't know, we may have a loop going both ways. Then that one hooks into this one and back out again. So, hopefully that's okay. I may change this line here to be straight over the top. I just didn't want to mess around with the, the city. And there's not enough room to go underground. I don't want it too far away. I thought that would do for now. That would do for now. And we'll see how this goes. So, I am going to set a loop going both directions. And then we're going to see how many passengers we get from there. So, this is going to be the anti-clockwise... And then we're going to find a name for this side of town. And that's going to go there. And that's going to go there. And that's going to go there. Um, what should we call this side of town? Should we call it South South Anticlockwise? We'll just call this the South Side of Town. Why not? So let's have a look at this. Uh, nope. Let's have a look at this. This is the one. Train line. So South Anti clockwise that'll do and then we'll do a south clockwise so we'll do a same one but going the other way create a new line now we'll go clockwise around here and then we'll change the color obviously so it's easy to stand out and i know some of you are already run into the comments telling me this isn't the perfect way of doing it i want to do it my way south clockwise there we go and we'll make that a nice purple colour. There we go. Actually, that's not. Let's change that to something entirely different. So it stands out. Green. Yeah, we can sort of see both lines running. There we go. So we have the orange trains. And we have the green trains. Nice. And we'll see how many trains that ends up on each line. Whether we need to change that amount so they're not backing up. Quick sip of tea. And all that sort of lovely stuff. Um, but apart from that, how's this going here? I've changed the junction here slightly, as you probably saw in that little montage. And that's probably helping this a bit. This could probably do with being a roundabout. I would imagine I'm going to end up changing that. But this here, people can get off at this one here when they want to change. And they can go over to the other one. What I will likely do... At the minute, I've got to walk around there. So I will set up some pathing. Pathing, pathing. So they can walk from one side to the other. I just want normal pedestrian path. That's in an entirely different menu. Weirdly, it's always in this one over here. Uh, and I may just see if I can go. Um, no, let's do it. Let's do it like this. Page down, page up. How far do I have to go? There we go. And then back down again. There we go. So they will walk out of there, go up there, over to... Whoops. One key, over to the other side. I could possibly do the same over here. There we go. So either side they come out. When they, when they want to, they can switch over. We haven't connected this one up yet, but we will do... Let's maybe follow one of our trains around. Uh, what's this one here? Oh, here we go. Let's do this instead. And enjoy the... This is the green one. So is this the anti-clockwise one? I've completely forgotten. And enjoy a ride around our city and see what it looks like. I like this. I like this. Oh, there's people waiting for us. Hello, every, every person. All jump on the train. Let's speed things up a bit. There we go. Let's slow it down a tiny bit as we go along. I like this city. I, I know that I sort of spotted a comment. I was looking before I started recording. Um, hello. That um, 
I don't need to sort of upgrade any of the town, you know, put more houses in, all the rest of it. I just need to do the transport. That is true, but I can't help tinkering. I, I like to tinker. If I see... I mean, the road's up. The road network needed to be upgraded. It still needs to change a bit. Oh, here we go, underground. Oh, we do get an underground view now, even though it's a bit winky-wonky. And there we go. I like tinkering with the roads, and I like sort of thinking that I'm the mayor in charge of growing everything in the town, even though I've been tasked by the mayor just to do the transport stuff. Um, of course, we all enjoy that anyway, because we're all excited for the new mass transit DLC, which is coming soon. There's a few people there, not so many. Hopefully it'll pick up as it goes along. I want to see what it's like as we get into one of the bigger cities, which we're, we're coming up to in a second. Let's... I like this mod, actually. You've been able to see... Oh, there we go. There's one of the... So we're coming into... Yeah, I know where this is. So we go in and out of this one. Will it automatically change us to look the other way? I imagine as soon as it starts moving, it won't. Okay, let's... <laughs> I thought it would. Ah, oh, it's put us right back to where we were. We are... We are in here. This is where we are. This is our train. Let's follow it this way, then. Is that going to take us the right way? Yes, it is. Okay, so now it's going back... This will be going up to the, not the farming, the tree district. It's not called the tree district at all. Past the incinerators. Yep, underground, that weird linking bit that we've got. Goes round the back to the left. Oh, there's another train waiting. Oh, what's going on here? Let's speed this up a bit. Oh, do we have a traffic jam? Okay, let's follow this round then. We went there, we went underground, we came up. Aha! Yes, we do have a traffic jam. So that I, that's where I was. I was waiting to come up into here. Yeah, we'll probably change this. This this wasn't the best set out, this station here. Let me just uh, let me just change this one. There we go. That works much better. We've got different colour trains now. <laughs> We've got blue and orange instead of green, I think it was before. Uh, it now goes underground and it loops back round. Oh, I haven't checked this little section here, whether that's still working okay. Um, let's have a quick look at that. Yeah, maybe we don't need that little crossover there anymore. That's fine. But now it comes around there, loops in one side, loops out the other. Yeah, we don't need this little cross section here. So I shall delete that. If it lets me... There we go. It's not messed up any of my lines. I don't think so. Good. There we go. So that's running nicely. So that's going to start ferrying people around this. And it's not too far to go. If somebody wants to get from here to here, they can take a train going that way. Or if they want to get down here, they can take a train going that way. They've got the choice which is good and then we're going to get this connected up like our double little section here coming across the river and then doing a similar thing over here what's the matter with you we've got some lines not connected up let's connect those good so i think that's going to work well i mean there's probably not many passengers at the moment because i've only just started them 12 and 16 that's not bad going at all we're still growing in money people are leaving which isn't good. So maybe we do need to take a look around at some issues and problems that we've got. I don't know. We're probably okay. I'll have a look off camera anyway. Any any major issues, I'll get those sorted. But I think that's a good start for getting people moving around. Using our transport. That's what we want to do. I just wanted to check the noise levels over here. Much better. Look, it's not spreading this way, which is good. So these people are happy. What's the matter with you? No more room at the cemetery. Let's empty you then. So there we go. If you guys enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit the big B with the T stain to subscribe. I'm going to hopefully try and make this a daily series. I will do my best, so keep your eyes out for that. Check out the other series I've got linked on the screen as well. Minecraft is now on my other channel, Biffa Plays. That's the home for Minecraft. Uh, but also lots of other indie games going on here every day of the week. So be sure to check those out. I will see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.